Please, big applause for Scorpio. Last August, the youth sing protests erupted uh, all around Lebanon, and Lebanese youth wanted to deliver their message to the rest of the world. Protesters posted thousands of photos and videos to social media and uh, used the youth sing and Tilatri Hitkun hashtags. And local as well as international uh, media outlets were scrambling to get content online. There were two, two problems though. One is that most users couldn't get their content outside of social media and reach mass media. And the second problem was the news outlets or media outlets could not effectively track all the images that were posted online or at least find them in time. My name is Noor Shamoun and I'm the Chief Creative Officer at Scopio. New York Times calls us Getty Images in real time. We are the first solution to find and license images on social media, on Instagram and Twitter, in under 10 minutes in real time. What we did essentially is build out a system where users or clients can track uh, photos and videos on social media in real time and license them through hashtags, through hashtag searches. So, uh, for example, if a protester um, uh, is posting a, uh, an event, is pro if, if a protester is posting an image about a live event that's happening, um, the let's say a media uh, outlet is looking for a specific photo from a specific hashtag, they can find that photo through our platform and send the user an automated message on Instagram or Twitter requesting for rights to the photo. Um, so why hashtags? Um, as you all know, hashtags are the center of every social event, and now even every brand campaign, or every, every, yeah, every brand campaign has a hashtag around it. Um, so, so yeah, that's that's the kind of the core of of what we do, and um, so. So we've built a library of thousands of hashtags. We've been building it for the past month. And uh, we've aggregated hashtags in different languages, including Arabic. And that has given us the chance to distribute to a larger, more global audience. And um, so this tech innovative solution is a, a two-fold win-win solution. The first, the user gets paid for their content, and second, the the client can access and license images on social media. And the client can be virtually anyone looking for user-generated content, from news agencies to um, products to brands that want it for commercial use and even individual use. Um, our diverse team is, uh, includes two MBAs, uh, a team of four uh, engineers with machine learning experience, the founder and myself. We are based in New York, as he said, and uh, we've been working out of the Columbia Startup Lab for the past year. And now, finally, we're ready to launch our beta product, which um, we're partnering with Reuters Images, Thomson Reuters based in London and New York, uh, as well as clients in the ad space and brand space. Um, and so why am I here? Um, I'm Lebanese and I think or we think that Lebanon and the Arab world has so much untapped potential in social media. And we would ve are very interested in, in uh, partnering with companies here as well as clients here to uh, just, br just penetrate that space. So um, if you're interested, please come and talk to us at our booth uh, just straight, straight ahead or visit our website at scopio.io. Thank you. There we go. Thank you very much. So, will this? So, you, you haven't launched it yet, right? Um, we, oh, the, the, the product. Um, we haven't, no, not yet, but we're very close to so my piloting question, it my, out. My question is like, okay, so let's say there's actually some kind of breaking news event, and I happen to be with my phone running in the street, like behind me, there's like a police track like chasing me or something. And that photo is like trending on Twitter, and you really want to republish that in New York Times front page. Now, have you tried at least some kind of whatever occasion where like how fast you actually get answer from that social media user? 
Our response rate has been so far 48% um, in real time. But so actually, no, that's a general response rate. In real time, it's within seconds or within minutes. That's okay. why I said under 10 minutes. Okay. It's very fast. And, and, uh, and the second part of that question is like, how does the, the price is determined? Because like, I mean, I'm just a guy in the street with an iPhone and I like this police running behind me and there's someone who's like, I want to buy your picture. On the spot. Yeah, but like, how does, how, like, is there any price on that? Like, how do you, how do you agree on the price? The price is a standard price. Um, I'm, I wouldn't be the one to ask for the price. I haven't done the pricing model, but the, I think the price that we've agreed on is $50 per image, but that definitely fluctuates, depends on the quality of the image, the virality of the image, and so on. Um, it can definitely be higher. Um, and the user, the thing I think I mentioned is that the user gets half of the, the, the cut, and then we get the other half, depends on what the I wouldn't care is. about the price if I'm running <coughs> with the cops behind me, though. But more questions? No more questions? We have one? Tara? No? Okay, well, thank, thank you very you. much. Thank you. Thank you, judges. Thank you, guys. Thank you.